Hi friends and welcome to Rev Force. The Apache RTI 204V race edition has been around for a year and it is one of the best 200cc commuters in the market currently. However, the Yamaha MT15 even though being a 150cc machine rivals the 200cc commuters with its fantastic power and performance. So, in today's video, I'm going to do a comparison review between the Apache 204V ABS and the Yamaha MT15. The Apache 204V looks attractive and the fit finish of the motorcycle is also good. Well, looks are subjective, but the MT15 looks fantastic and a lot more appealing. When it comes to power output, the Apache's 197.7cc oil-cooled 4-valve engine produces 20.5 bhp at 8500 rpm and 18.1 Nm of torque at 7000 rpm. The MT15 on the other hand gets a 155cc liquid-cooled 4-valve engine producing 19.3 bhp at 10,000 rpm and 14.7 Nm of torque at 8,500 rpm. The MT15 has a very good low-end performance than the Apache, however the 204V has a solid mid-range. Maneuvering the MT15 is such an easy task as it is the best handling motorcycle but being on the lighter side, the MT15 is not as good as the Apache on the highways, especially when there is so much of wind blast. Both the motorcycles get slipper clutch and the gear shifting is also smooth. However, the 6-speed gearbox on the MT15 is better than the Apache's 5-speed gearbox and the variable valve actuation on the MT also offers better torque at higher speeds. The handlebar setup of the Apache is a little committed whereas the MT15 gets an upright handlebar setup. But both the motorcycles offer great maneuverability and handling. The Apache gets a bigger fuel tank with a capacity of 12 liters when compared to the MT's 10 liter fuel tank. Both the motorcycles should retain a fuel efficiency of 37 to 42 kmpl. The exhaust note on both the motorcycles are equally good as it is crisp. And throttle. Both the motorcycles get conventional telescopic front forks and monoshock rear suspension. But the suspension setup of the MT15 is better as it takes on bad roads effortlessly and it even inspires a lot of confidence to the rider, especially at the corners. When it comes to braking, the 204V offers fantastic stopping power as it gets dual channel ABS unit with rear lift protection. However, the MT15 just gets a single channel ABS unit with the rear wheel still prone to locking out. The Apache gets Remora tires from TVS whereas the MT15 gets MRF tires and it also gets a broader 140 by 70 rear section which inspires a lot of confidence to the rider. When it comes to ride comfort, the split seat setup of the Apache is much better as it is broad enough and offers comfortable riding experience to the rider and the pillion when compared to the MT15 single piece seat which doesn't offer comfortable riding experience especially to the pillion rider. But the pillion grab rails on both the motorcycles are very well placed and it is easy to hold on to. The all digital instrument cluster on both the motorcycles offer a lot of information. The MT15 gets a negative LCD unit which has a gear position indicator, two trip meters, odometer, ABS indicator, gear shifting indicator and the fuel gauge. But the 204V's LCD unit is better as it is easily readable and it also gets a top speed recorder, lap timer and a lot more. The bifunctional LED headlamp unit on the MT15 is one of the best features of the motorcycle as it offers good amount of reach and visibility. But the Apache only gets LED DRLs with halogen headlamp unit which doesn't offer good amount of reach. However, 
both the motorcycles get LED tail light setup and halogen indicator units. The Apache 204V is one of the best motorcycles in its segment as it offers very good low end performance combined with solid mid range and decent top end performance. It also gets dual channel ABS which offers fantastic stopping power and it inspires a lot of confidence to the rider. But the MT-15 is such a fantastic motorcycle which offers great maneuverability and handling especially when riding at traffic conditions. The LED headlamp setup, the aggressive looks and the design makes the MT-15 the most appealing motorcycle in its segment. There is not even a single motorcycle in the 150cc commuter segment which offers such a great performance like the MT-15. However, the MT-15 doesn't get a dual channel ABS unit which is a big disappointment as a motorcycle of this class surely requires it to ensure better safety and ride control. Yamaha just nailed it in terms of design and performance but certainly not in terms of pricing as it costs 1.6 lakh rupees on road Chennai. The Apache 204V on the other hand is being priced at 1.35 lakh rupees on road Chennai. The Apache has its own shortcomings as it doesn't get a 6-speed gearbox and a LED headlamp unit. So if you guys look out for a motorcycle which offers good amount of performance combined with excellent braking, then the Apache 204V ABS is a very good motorcycle to choose from. But if you just want a motorcycle which offers so much of fun with great maneuverability and performance, then the MT-15 is what you can get but at the expense of 25,000 rupees more than the Apache which doesn't sound great. Well, this concludes my comparison review. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe to my channel and hit the like button. Comment the motorcycle that you would choose out of these two. I'll see you guys in the next review. Until then, take care and ride safe.